friends welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new my name is Ashley and today I have some weekly laundry motivation for you today I'm starting out with what I consider a very easy load to wash um, and that is the towels the reason why I consider it very easy is because I do not mind folding and putting away towels it goes very quickly and I don't mind it at all so that is the load I decided to start off with today I've already put the towels in the washer, I've added the laundry detergent and then the Lysol sanitizer. Anytime I am washing towels or bedding or if we're sick or anything, I always like to throw in Lysol sanitizer. So now that I have them in the washer, they're all washed at this point, so I'm going to transfer them into the dryer, get them all dried. And then the second load of laundry that I'm going to tackle today will be mine and Nick's clothes. I will go ahead and throw all of our dirty laundry in the washer, get them all washed and clean while the towels are drying. If you have any type of laundry that you need to tackle today, why don't you go ahead and grab that load and let's get to washing, drying, and folding together. Like I always say, there's no better way to tackle some laundry than tackling it with a friend, and I really would love to be that friend for you today. If you don't have any laundry that you need to get done, maybe you have something on your to-do list that you would like to check off. If that's the case, then go ahead and grab that to-do list, and let's get to hopefully giving you some motivation to get whatever it is on that to-do list checked off as well. Yes, you see Ryder, he is always underneath me usually most of the time. This is summertime right now, so he... Um, just is loving hanging out. This was earlier in the morning, so he was just trying to figure out what we were going to do for the day. So he came in there and asked me while I was trying to tackle all of this laundry. But now that the towels are dried, I'm going to go ahead and take them out of the dryer, throw them on my bed, so that way I can fold them and put them away. And then I'm going to transfer mine and Nick's clothes into the dryer, get them all dried, and then start on the third load of laundry, which will be Madison's clothes. So I know that it's been a while since I've uploaded a video and I really do hate that. Like I always say, um, and I'm sure you guys get super tired of hearing this, we have just been so busy. There's been a lot going on and there's a few things that I will be sharing with you guys. Some exciting news as well, but I'm not going to be sharing that in today's video yet. Um, just because everything's not really fully finalized, but we do have some exciting stuff going on in our family. But then we've also just had some things that's happened that's like, oh my goodness what's next you know um, so this summer this is when the video was filmed actually was this summer and my kids are back in school now and they've been in school for about three weeks so that's how far behind I am I do have other videos filmed too I just have not had the time to sit down and like edit uh, do voiceovers and upload them so I'm trying to get all of that knocked out so that way I do have a few videos um, coming up for you guys as well but um, this during the summertime towards the end of summer I was taking my 13 year old which is Jeremiah to camp for a week and on our way there a teenager hit me um, in the passenger side door so in the front of the passenger side too um, so my van had to go into you know the shop to get fixed and we just recently got it back and of course just my luck um, I was driving home really late one night uh, picking Madison up from dance recently and a deer just came out and hit the left side of my or my right side of the car which is my passenger side so that we have to get fixed again now which you know just my luck and then 
Um, not too long ago, I was taking Jeremiah to a cross-country meet, and Nick was taking Ryder to baseball practice, and we were leaving at the same time. So I was in his car, and I rolled down the driver window just to tell them bye. And as I was rolling it up, it was not rolling up correctly, so now we have to get that fixed as well. Like I said, it's just one thing after the next. But we do have some also very exciting news and um, great things going on as well. I just, like I said, I'm not going to be sharing that in today's video, but I will be sharing very soon. Full stop Can't believe I live in your thoughts I think about you all the time Morning, evening, and midnight Such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I Expected love was found You're the rose in a garden And it shows if I'm honest You're the leaves in mid-August And I've come out here to say So day one, I finished up by taking all of Madison's clothes out of the dryer, placing them in her room for the, her to fold and put away herself. And then I did the same thing when we got back from the pool with the older boys' clothes. I put their clothes in a laundry basket and placed that basket in their room for them to fold and put away, but that did not happen. You'll see that I'm the one that's folding and putting away everything later in this video. But this is day two now, and all I was able to accomplish on day two was washing and drying Ryder's clothes, and then I just placed them in a basket and I got to them another day with folding. And then on day three, all that I was able to accomplish on day three was folding and putting away mine and Nick's clothes. Like I said, it's just been very crazy busy for us lately. We've had showings and we've had other things going on because our house is still in the market um, as of now. So that's just, like I said, it's just been a very super busy time for our family. And then on day um, four, you'll see me fold all the other kids' clothes. So Ryder's clothes, I'll put them away. At Jacob and Jeremiah's laundry, I will fold their clothes and hang up their shirts and put them away as well. 
So like I said earlier, this was filmed during summertime for our family and the kids have been back in school for about three weeks now. And yes, I definitely miss summer, but I am so glad that the kids are back in school. And it's not because I don't want them home with me because that's not the case. I love having the kids home with me and I love all the breaks that we get throughout the year. It is really nice, but what I am like excited about is just being on like a routine again and a schedule again. We know what each day, what's going to happen, what the kids have activity wise each day and everything. So it's just nice to be back on a schedule and a routine. Um, even though I feel like we're way more busy now because of all the activities starting back up and stuff. Um, I just like having all of that and knowing everything. So that's why I'm glad that they're back in school. I would love to know if your kids are back in school, if you have children, um, or when they're gonna go back to school. I know that some schools just went back not too long ago in different states. But um, like I said, our kids have had three full weeks of school already, and then they had um, two days previous to the three full weeks. So um, we went back early August, um, but it is, like I said, nice to have them back in school. I definitely miss them, um, but I do miss summer as well, too. But yeah, definitely leave me a comment down below letting me know if your children are back in school, if you have children, or when they're going to go back to school. I would love to know. So I'm just finishing up right now with um, Ryder's laundry. I'm just folding everything and then I'm going to be just putting away all of his laundry. You will see a little fade out part here in a minute. That's because my battery and my camera died and it did not like notify me. Normally it beeps, but it did not on this day. So you won't see me fully fold everything, but for the most part I did um, fold everything for you on video. Um, so now I'm done with his laundry, so I'm just going to go ahead and put that away. And here I go, starting on Jacob and Jeremiah's laundry. I'm going to hang up all their shirts, fold everything, and of course put everything away for them. As always, you will see me kind of smell this jersey for a minute. I felt like it kind of smelled funny to me, but then I re-smelt it and it smelled fine. Um, I don't know. I was... I've been out of my scented beads for a little while. I finally got some more. Um, so I was just trying to like sniff everything because those are baseball jerseys. And for some reason, I felt like it had an odor just because it didn't have scented beads um, in this load. But I finally got them and everything was fine and their clothes smelled fine as well. But that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed hanging out with me and I hope I was able to give you some type of motivation to either get some laundry done or get some cleaning done, get something checked off your to-do list. Whatever it might have been, I hope I gave you the motivation you needed to get it done. Maybe you didn't need to get anything done and you just decided to hang out with me. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that as well. Definitely let me know down below in the comments if you were able to get something done or if you just decided to hang out with me on this day. I would love to know. Also, don't forget to like this video. It really does help my channel out and it would just mean the world to me as well. So that way I know that you're liking what I'm putting out and you want to see more of it. Definitely um, come back next week for some more laundry motivation and cleaning motivation. And as always, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to hang out with me. It truly does mean the world. I'll catch you in the next one, friends. Bye. Every time we touch, I feel at home. There's no way I ever let you go. When you put your hands in mine, I know I'm gonna be alright. I don't know what you do to me, but I feel like I am wake up in the sky. When you put your hands in mine, I know I'm gonna be alright. Cause when we touch, is when I really come alive. When I really come alive mm -hmm, yeah. I don't know anybody That could compare to you The way you're always smiling The way you light up a room I couldn't live without you Not even if I tried Cause every day I'm with you I'm flying over the clouds Oh yeah Yeah I'm flying over the clouds